Yo guys, it's me Matrix here, bringing you another edition of the Ruby Isles AGC Challenge, the Ace Gym Challenge. I keep saying AGC Challenge, challenge twice, but you know, what can you do? Um, we are bringing you a match against, I believe, Rykustic? Uh, Rykustic of the Scorching Wildlands Gym, uh, with his Ace Center Scorch and type speciality of Bug and Fire. Now, I've got a really, really interesting team this week, and still unsure about it, still unsure about it. Uh, you can kind of see it just there, down below. Um, so I've been... Yeah, let's get into it, shall I? I'm, I've decided to not bring uh, Alakazam anymore, and instead I'm going to bring Indeedy. So this team is kind of inspired a little bit by Otto for the fact that I'm running Primarina, Dragapult, and Indeedee with Round for really fast um, hyper voices for Primarina. So like I can lead Dragapult, go Round, then Primarina follows straight afterwards and gets a huge uh, round off, double damage, actually more than hyper voice does, boosted with Mystic Water um, to do big stuff. Or I can go Indeedee with Follow Me. Um, or Togetic will follow me with Primarina and go for Carmine's shenanigans. Uh, indeed, he is faster than Primarina as well, so like a round would help me there. Like if he's running slow mons, like say Center Scorch and that, which is his max mon. So indeed, he should be faster than that. But we've got Rhyperia for the ground and foot for the ground and rock type coverage for fire for the fire and bug. Um, I obviously ground is resisted by bug types, but it's always nice to get special defense boosts, isn't it? Um, but no, the main the main star of this team is this power trick Shuckle, which I really want to work, which is why we're going Shuckle with Indeedy and Togetic. We get Shuckle in, have Indeedy set it up, uh, set up the next Indeedy, Togetic in the back, and either Primarina, Dragapult, or Rhyperia behind all them. So we'll see if we can get this going. Um, it's it's stupid. It is actually a stupid team. Uh, we might just take a massive loss, but we do have some like good mons as well, like Dragapult, Primarina, Indeedy, and Rhyperia. Rhyperia being questionable, questionable about being a good mon. I did have the Rhyperia on the team <clears throat> alongside uh, Alkazam though originally, which was allowing me to go for like speed swap into it, and then Rhyperia does big damage, but. Uh, yeah, not anymore. So, Rhyperia is doing less work here than I would like it to, other than maybe just tanking a few hits. Um, I do think, though, instead of weakness policy, I think I'm just going to run one berry on it. Uh, just because of who I'm going against. And that, that reminds me, I don't need the Dragon Berry on Dragapult anymore. Because I'm not going against the Dragon type gym. So, Eviolite, Focus Sash, Mystic Water, that's fine. Habanberry, I don't need. So move you over here. Move you. I'm going to give you the Lumberry. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Bit of a horse throat. Um, fire and Bug. Fire and Bug. Maybe it might be a good idea to give him safety goggles. Um... Could just run Specs Dragapult to be honest. Maximize that damage output. Will he be ring dark type moves? Not really. He is clear body. Honestly, I might just chuck Specs on it. And go from there. And just replace Protect. <laughs> um, helping hand. What do I want? Shadow Ball, maybe? I got a grind. Um, what fire types resist rock? Not resist rock. What fire types stop water? I could just go for Dragon Balls to be honest. I'm not running for a meteor. Uh, don't think there's any bug types. Well, there's a Raquinid. A Raquinid could be an issue. 
So I haven't actually thought of a rack Um I'm just gonna give it shadow ball. No, I don't want to do that. Um Oh it has has stricken me too already. Uh sorry about this. You know what, I'm just gonna give it a life up. Showed up. Oh. oh, on showdown. I thought it was on Wi Fi. No worries. I can show. Just waiting for his response. Will this video see the light of day? Yeah, sure. All right, guys, I'll speak to you shortly and we'll see. And we're back. So we are paired up with Rykoustic. And we are so not ready for this. Let's go. So fire and bug types only for him. Where are you? You're here. Let the battle begin. Now, this plan is so bad. It's so, so bad. Yeah, so he does have Incineroar, and I was thinking about this Scizor. Uh, he have Incineroar and Scizor, they're two I was worried about as well. Um, Primarina looks really good though in the back, so we'll do Prim. So, we'll go for the Shuckle. We'll go for the NDDD. Togetic. And the Primarina. Um, I kind of wish I had safety goggles um, on something now, because I was worried about a Butterfree coming. It's literally all the Mons I didn't want to come. Please let me do this. <laughs> you literally got such a broken team with Incineroar, Cinderace, Arcanine. Like, should have brought some competitive mods as well, to be honest. I was thinking of bringing competitive slash defiant. Oof. Sizzle's annoying with a bullet punch, but psychic terrain. Arcanine and Center Scorch. Oh, he's not even gonna let me set it up. Okay. Let's go, Shark Gold. Let's go. Alright, so he is just leading it. Um so he has ruined my attack stat, but that's okay. Alright, we're going for power trick. We go for follow me. And we'll have to go for a meteor beam into the center scorch the following turn. Oh, he's not going for a max straight out of the gate. Does he go for heat wave? Because I really don't want him to. Oh, come on. Oh, yes, yeah, Shuckle, thank you for missing. Leave the Shuckle alone. Leave it alone. Okay, you use knockoff. KOs me because I am the grass but berry anyway, the other berry. Power trick. Come on, shuckle.
Alright. We are just gonna go I don't know if I survive heat wave with my flimsy defenses right now. So we are just gonna go for a max. <laughs> to you. We're just gonna use follow me again. Yeah, it makes sense that you withdraw Center Scorch, it does make sense. But this is why we're using a special shuffle. Intimidate's fine. I should probably have got rid of the Arcanine, to be honest, to, to its uh, Heat Wave could do some damage here. Shuckle! Come on, Shuckle! Survive this Heat Wave with more than 50% health. Please. Get one KO, that's all I ask for. Oh my god, that's, that's that's actually really cool. That's fine. You get the Heat Wave, double burn. We're going for special shuffle anyway. Okay, that did not do as much as I thought it would. I wonder why. Huh. Did this not work the way I was wanting it to? Does it not work for Max Mons? Oh, it mustn't work. So Power Trick doesn't actually work if you max your um, Mon. Huh. It must reset the stats. That did not work the way I was expecting it to. Well, did not work as intended. Okay, well, we wasted a max. What a shame. Um, I suppose. I'm actually kind of disappointed with that. Like, I was expecting it to do more. Yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed, to be honest. That power trick didn't work the way I wanted it to. Oh, it means I'm going to have to revert back to my other team. Okay. That's fine. So we can take his try attack. Get a status. Now we freeze. Cool. Okay, so you're a Charty Berry. Yeah, nah, that's really taken out of me a bit. I was expecting the power trick to work through. Like, I don't understand why it would revert and ignore. Um, okay. It is what it is. Might as well go for Max Quake into the Arcanine. Um, you're frozen, so you could be indefinitely frozen. So let's just go for a try attacking to Arcanine. Oof. Oh, don't. Yeah, okay, Incineroar, so it's just going to intimidate me again. It's really put a bad taste in my mouth. I'm like, come on. Why didn't it work? You know? I mean, it's doing something, I suppose. <sighs> shuckle. Shuckle, shuckle, shuckle. What are we gonna do? Huh. Like, is it so easily just able to stall out this max as well? I don't burn, so like, that's doing nothing. Um, but like, Shuckle's attacks are so low. I wonder if it's reverted back to normal here, so. Um, I'm gonna go for the meteor beam. Just get out. And get get rid of it. Um, tr -tr -tr -tr. 
I don't know what it's done the Patrick. I don't know if Patrick's uh, in effect, if it's not. Uh, I'm going to go for a follow me here. Butter freeze for in solid. Flare blitz into Togetic. All right, Primarina's going to have to do something magical here. <laughs> yeah, like it must have done the power trick and it must have reset it through maxing, which is really annoying. Yeah, this this did not go at all as planned. Understand why it didn't work. So, which is attack stat with its defense stat? Oh, it's only attack and defense, not special attack. That's why. Okay, that makes more sense now. I'm gonna go for the rock slide then. <clears throat> um, which means I go for a calm mind here. Um, <clears throat> that was funny. Okay, so I'm at, so Primary is actually faster than his Incineroar. That's kind of cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I made such a mistake. I should have. Oh, okay, that's fine. Sounds so I'm just excited. Butterfree, you are super annoying here. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna go for a round. Oh, I can't believe I made that mistake there. Stomping Tantrum. Interesting. Oh, we're speed tied. That's why. Okay. Oh, I can't move. Give me a second. Okay, so you have max overgrowth. That's cool. Now, the, the, this uh, definitely is not going to work <laughs> the way I wanted it to. Uh, <laughs> geez. Oh, dear. Okay, should have brought White Herb on the um, Shuckle then. Okay, so the Heat Wave. That was painful, not gonna lie. <clears throat> it's okay, we'll try and get two more. We'll try and double win from here. Uh, five taps have a lot of coverage though, so super annoying. All right, we're gonna lead Primarina in DD. Um, Dragapult in the back with maybe Togetic. 
as long as it was still nice. Because um, it can help drag a ball. Let's go. Let's go. Insane and butterfree. Yeah, that's fine. Go Primarina and Indeedy. <laughs> okay, so. Butterfree is going to be annoying, um, so I can go for a round and round. Um, I'm actually more worried about the Butterfree here than anything. So yeah, I'm just going to go for a round and round. <clears throat> uh, you got to go for that stupid fast sleep powder. This has just gone all to shit. Man. Just not gone well at all for me. Yeah, you can go for a passing shot, it's fine. Looks like Raiku. Ray, what's your name? Raikustic. It looks like we'll be uh, playing another day. Because I cannot, for the life of me, do well here. Because <clears throat> you can just sleep out of me with a butterfree. Like, there's no reason why you don't, to be fair. You just go for double sleep powder. Um, you max, well, you don't even need to max sense of scorch. Hopefully, I wake up and just hit a hydro cannon. That'd be nice. Removes your max. Before you get a chance. Come on, come prim, come prim. Yes! Hit it, hit it. Oh, that's gotta be a salt vest to live that. <clears throat> wow. Okay. That was. I'm, so, I'm shocked. That's a Mystic Water Boosted Primarina. Like, wow. That has to be, uh, so that has to be, um... That's fine, I'm gonna bring Dragapult out here. But, Dragapult... Yeah, I have to bring Dragon Ball. <clears throat> <clears throat> Problem is, is that this Butterfree is just going to sleep me and it's going to be super annoying. So I've got to go for a attack like that. And a Max Geyser into the Butterfree. Because I haven't brought a flying type move. <clears throat> Like, he has got knockoff as well, so what am I supposed to do? <laughs> like, he's so free to knock off my Dragapult, and that's going to be doing huge damage to me. I'm really... Uh, he's going to go for Max Atlas, yeah. I'm really upset that I messed up the Shuckle. Um, obviously, back to the drawing board now. And I really regret not picking up safety goggles to be put on. Like, I, I felt like safety goggles was needed for something. Dragapult in specific. Um, rage powder. Yeah, that's fine. Here you go for a Max Geyser. It was always hitting a butt free here anyway. 
It doesn't even KO. These are just missing out on the KOs. Just can't catch a break. <clears throat> Max Darkness into Pult, that's fine. It should survive for me. I don't know. Yeah, thought so. Um, Primarina one turn, sleep, wake up again. That'd be nice. Nah, I didn't think so. That's cool. That is rather cool. Um, got to go for Hydra Cannon into the Center Scorch again. No. We go for a round into Butterfree and we max guard in the hopes that you wake up. Yeah, you go for the Rage Powder, that's fine. Ah, uh, damn it. Power Whip, Chaos. Yeah, this is GG. I told you, I, t I told him before the battle, like, this is not going to be like any other match. He will most likely win. Um, Definitely a pain that the he had double intimidate and got that burn off, and I just miss figuring out what that uh, was supposed to do. Um, it's okay, it's not over. It is not over. Um, we go for a follow me. See if this is. Hmm. Don't really need it to do that. Honestly, he's best going for um, I Sleep Powder or or Rage Powder. Cool. <clears throat> so he does just go for Sleep Powder. Take out Sensor Scorch. If I had Protect, I would have used Protect there. Um, a Max Strike might have been better. I don't know. Uh, if I, even more annoying, like, that other turn, when I maxed the Shuffle, I didn't need to max, I could have just gone for Rock Slides. Um, because it was set up and it was never taking that much damage from a heat wave. So, unfortunate. Uh, if only I had to surf here. Like, you can't do anything there. So, go for a follow me in the hopes that he wakes up. Um, Round into the butterfree just to remove it, I suppose. Could also protect it. Uh, I mean, I'm not losing anything from just protecting. I mean, it doesn't lower my stats anyway, so. Not doing anything there. Um, let's go for a try attack into the Incineroar slot and we'll go for a round into the Butterfree slot for the KO. Life Orb, yep. Passing shots. Clear body. Try attack. Let's go. Status? Nah, okay. Hmm. Incineroar is going to be annoying to stop. Arcanine? Yeah. <clears throat> uh, 
<clears throat> Look, I, I just gotta go for Follow here. I don't know who is going to be more offensive, but I've got to go for like Hydro Pump into one of you. Arcanine can go for spread moves, so let's go for the Arcanine. Hydro Pump, don't miss. <laughs> Heat Wave, don't KO. Don't burn. Don't burn. Okay. Okay. Try attack into the Arcanine, protect the Dragapult because I've already got maybe one more attacking me. <coughs> Heatwave, that's fine. Togetic, please don't die to a double up here. Nice. Please KO the Arcanine. Okay, that's enough to KO. Oh my god. Um, okay, so we go for a Follow Me into a Draco Meteor. Into a second Draco Meteor. Oh no, okay, that's GG. GG. I miss. I, I I don't win this. I can't. No, I can't win this from here. Um I don't actually know what does more. I would imagine Hydro Pump does more. Um So let's go for the Hydro Pump. I just needed that Dragon Meteor to have hit. GG. Yeah. GG's man. My tech failed me. So hard. Ah well. GG's Raikou Stick. This match will be held until I actually beat your gym because I'm not uploading a failed gym match, but just for the sake of it, I'll double it up um, with the when I actually beat you. So till next time. See you later, guys. Yo guys, it's me Matrix here. We are back again with the Ruby Isles Ace Gym Challenge. We are here for the rematch, the long awaited. Although for you guys, this is probably just gonna be a follow on from the video, previous video I released. Um, we have got a, up against um, Rykusik and the Fire and Bug Gym, the Scorch Gym Badge. Uh, they beat us last time. I didn't know the mechanics overly well of one of my <laughs> special modes. So we are back again, and this time we're going to try and do it a little bit better. So, as the same as last time, we've got Indeedy here. This time we're running safety goggles. I'm not sure if I ran it with safety goggles last time. I can quickly check that. No, we did not. Um, so, we're running it with safety goggles this time. Uh, for the pesky rage powder slash uh, sleep sleep powder from the butterfree um, from the bug and fire gym. Obviously, as many of you know, the AGC gym challenge is 
Basically, each gym has a Ace Mon, which this one is a Center Scorch, which means they can only max the Center Scorch, G Max variant, and they can only use Bug and Fire type mobs in this gym. So, yeah. Uh, we've got the Expanded Force, we've got Protect this time, Mystical Fire Expanded Force, uh, Safety Goggles to redirect. We still have the Paratrick Shuckle, this time Rock Slide, Earthquake and Knock Off. This time we have changed it a little bit, it is the Contrary variant, and we have got it running a Raw Sperry to stop any burns. Um, so we're trying to make this really physically offensive, and um, we do have a bit of attack investment in it. That's only so that when it swaps with the Power Swap, or Power Trick even, I'm hoping that uh, it gives me some a little bit more defense. Um, we are running Rock Slide and Earthquake and Knock Off, uh, just in case I want to do Max Darkness or something. We are running Sword Stance, Car Chomp with Surf, Rock Slide and Stomping Tantrum. You might be thinking, well, Surf, why is that? Well, one, yeah, I suppose it can do some damage to uh, water types, um, to fire types, even though the attack stat is so much better. Um, Sword Stance is just set up behind my redirection. Um, but the Surf is actually there for this little beauty where you tie Ranatar, Hydro Pump, Ancient Power, Thunderbolt and Iron Defense. Uh, special T-Tar with Unnerve and Weakness Policy. Um, so yeah, hopefully get that partnership off at some point. Uh, we have got Togekiss, so the upgrade from Togetic this time with Thunder Wave, Ancient Power, Air Slash and Follow Me. I felt like Togetic was just a bit not doing much last time, so... Hopefully Togekiss can help a little bit, it is a max option, um, it can do a bit more damage range of powers and be a little bit disruptive with Thunder Waves. Um, obviously we are using Serene Grace um, for the crit, for the flinch kiss and stat boost if it allows for it. We're running Flip Turn, Kingdra with Hydro Pump, Hurricane, Drake or Meteor it is Life Orb, minimum attack to try and help the Tyranitar out with uh, some with that there and it works pairs well with um, Tyranitar after Tyranitar has set to rain with Hydro Pump. Um, we've got the Thunderbolt just basically to stop any sleep spam stuff. Uh, you never know um, for like the Butterfree and stuff. I do think the Tyranitar is a little bit weak though uh, to the Max Flutterby from, from Sensor Scorch, so it is another mode that's a bit like oh, maybe, maybe not. It will be at plus one rather than plus two, and it will be a salt vested Tyranitar, so uh, Sensor Scorch more than likely. Um, it is unnerved though to stop any, um, basically to stop him from eating berries, which could be really helpful. And then, yeah, that's the team. So I'll catch you guys in a bit when we connect up. And we're back. We're here with Raikou Sick. <sighs> yes, we're going to use the exact same mode. He already, he's already aware of what I'm going to be doing, um, since he's already seen it once. Um, series 9, because we do max. Um, where are we? We are here. So, at least game 1, you'll have an idea. I don't know who I'm going to bring in the back this time. It depends on what he's brought. Okay, so he's got Silvala. That's a that's cheap, cheap. Silvala is cheap. He doesn't actually bring Intimidate, which is super annoying. I'm not gonna lie, but at least he doesn't have Fake Out this time. So I can actually lead Shuckle and Togekiss without having Fake Out. But I do like the fact that I don't want to be um, indeeded. Uh, Charizard with Torkoal is not too bad. I'm fine with that. And he has brought Torkoal to stop any rain stuff. Um, do I want Togekiss? Yeah, we'll bring Togekiss because you never know. At least it's got some offensive potential. And I, I personally want to bring Garchomp. Even though uh, Cinderace is really annoying. I think Garchomp is fast. What, what's my speed on Garchomp? I've got time. Do I outspeed a Charizard? Don't think I do. I think Charizard's 167. That'll be fine. That's fine. We're going for the Shuckle play again. <laughs> Depending on where he leads, I might not actually go for the follow me turn one. Because I'm slower. And I'm bulky. I might want to keep the follow me for a later turn. So. And who knows, I might not even max the Shuckle. 
No, I've got a Max of Shuckle. It'd be it cowardly if I don't. Butterfree and Torkoal. Yeah. Super annoying. Like, I've got to go for the Follow Me just because it's uh, Sleep Powder. Although, I will be annoyed if this Butterfree goes for, like, Bug Buzz. <laughs> Okay, so we're going for Power Trick. <laughs> here we go. Got to go for the Follow Me here because I don't want to be sleep powered. Thank you very much. Is this Torkoal going to be really strong? Yes, yes it is. You've seen it before. Yeah, the sleep powder. No, you're not getting that onto me this time. Heat Wave. I'm not especially bulky. I'm okay. Be a bulky boy. <sighs> I don't want to max it too too soon, so I'm just going to go for the rock slide. And I have to go for the follow me because if I'm not thinking, he, he probably will die to a bug buzz, but it's fine. I'm not maxing the shuffle this time. <laughs> Yeah, I, I can't not go for the follow me when it risks a sleep powder. Let's go. Good damage. Eh, crit and butterfree made no difference. Charizard. I've got to go for the rock slide again. Part of me wants to go for the protect with the NDD here. Um, heat wave won't KO Shuckle. A double heat wave might. So I'm just going to go for the protect because I think he does go for a double heat wave, to be honest. Yeah, he goes for a double heat wave here. Th this heat wave might actually KO my shuckle. Yeah. Poor shuckle. Soul Power Charizard. Um, I'm just going to bring Guard Jump out. I'm not... Do I max the guard chomp? Probably not. It's best not to. Let's go for that. I do think he... <sighs> I'm going to go for the follow me anyway. Yeah, that's okay. I think the Charizard does uh, go for a heat wave to try and get a burn or something here, but... Yeah. That's big damage. It's big, big damage. So he is faster with his Charizard. Is it Charity Berry on the Charizard? No. Okay, so Charizard goes down. And then we bring out Togekiss. And Togekiss is now my max option. going for a rock slide here because we might as well and Max Rockfall does more and I think I outspeed the Center Scorch um, so let's just do that I'm sorry Shuckle for not going for your play um, the, the spread moves were just too much for me Max Flutterby would be the smartest play, I would imagine. 
So I don't think it gets anything that hits me too hard other than Max Fire. Like, obviously, uh, Centiferno would do a lot. Especially in Sun. But that's why I'm hoping that this uh, Max Wall 4 will get rid of the Sun. Guard jump. Okay, this is good for my Tyran my Tyranitar. But it's also good for Togekiss being able to hit it now with Max Rockfall. Oh, it doesn't KO, but the Sand will KO the Center Scorch and the Torque all this turn. So just live. Yeah, Flutterby was smart. Onto the Garchomp. Low is uh, Togekiss' special attack, as he's figured that Togekiss would be the one that had to max this game. Oh, yeah, we'll talk about Flinch, didn't really matter, to be honest. Yeah, definitely glad I went for the Rockfall. <laughs> Disappointing that I haven't brought Rain Dance. <laughs> I only just won that. I only just won. That was close. <laughs> um, I'm definitely going to bring Titar this time. <laughs> Kingdra would be nice. So if I lead Tyrant attack Kingdra, I might be able to get a weakness policy proc off. Garchomp plus Togekiss. Might be alright. I'm sorry, Shuffle. You just took too much damage with those heat waves. For me to realistically use you. Those heat waves were strong. It might be a bad idea as well. Butterfree is really fast. I think I outspeed Butterfree though with at least Kingdra, so that's something. Maybe I should have brought Indeedy, but maybe I've popped him off from bringing Butterfree with uh, my safety goggles, Indeedy. It's nice that it's not Focus Ash or um, Charity Berry, which means Focus Ash has to be elsewhere. It also has to be Fire Drive on Silvalli, which could be Parting Shot. There's a the Silvalli. Mm hmm. Tyranitar and A uh, Bug Silvalli. That's interesting. Um. I am going to go for a max, max Rockfall into Torkoal and a flip turn into Tita. i got to be careful, like multi-attack will do big damage here. Might be smarter to have like D&D and gone go for an Iron Defense or something, but... You know, can't win all. Um, I think Silv Ally boosts before Tyranitar as well. So if it does he go for a punch line to T Tar or does he go into Kingdra? Ah, oh, it protects. Yeah, that makes sense to be fair. Okay, so Kingdra's at least faster than Tita, which is kind of cool. And then we bring Garchomp out. Into the Garchomp. Shame that, um... 
Kingdra was actually faster than the Silvalli there. I know it gets brought out. Oh, okay, Center Scorch. Oh, if I had gone into that Center Scorch slot. Tasty. That's, that's big damage, though. You get the sand up for Garchomp and for Tita. Um, if we go for a geyser into the center scorch, now nah, we go for the rock fall into the center scorch, I think. Because what's he got in the back? Anything that can take a rock move? No, like he is left having to. Um, And I could just go for a sword stance here. What do you think I'm going to do? Because I don't think he lets the center scorch go down here. The talk hole is definitely switching out there. Okay, so he does max the center scorch, so he could just be going for a max guard, which would be fine for me. Because my guard jump's faster than my um, Torkoal, faster than my uh, Kingdra, and Kingdra outsped, so Sword Stance here just allows me to really hit hard next turn. If he goes for a max guard, yeah, that's fine. I don't get the geyser up, which is unfortunate, but it's not terrible either. Max rock fall into the center scorch. And a rock slide should do big damage to both. I think Tyrannus is faster than the center scorch as well. If he's not running speed. So I flinched. Oof, big. Yeah. Tyranitar is faster than a non invested Sense of Scorch, so <laughs> bye bye. There's the Torkoal. I am going to Max Guys in the Torkoal this turn. Ah, I can't. Okay. So Tyranitar can go for an Ancient Power. Into the Torkoal. Let me go for a Rock Slide. He won't know that I'm special. Torkoal should protect him. Yeah. I, I should I should double the uh, Silver Light, to be honest. If this Rock Slide misses, then yeah, I should have. Nah, it's fine. Yeah, as I say, like he had to swap out the Torkoal if he wanted the Thun resetting before, which is why I didn't mind going for the Sword Stance with the Guard Chomp. But having two pseudos on the field seems a little bit overkill, I'm not going to lie. And I know his guard jump's faster than me. His Charizard's faster than mine, so there is that. Um, but hey ho, ancient power, rock slide. Here we go. Dragon Pulse into the Garchomp, that could KO actually. That did, that did, that did KO. That's nice. Tyranitar, use Ancient Power into Charizard. 
There we go. It's dead. Ooh, solar be not completely there, but I this might this might even cut uh, my talent off. No, not enough. Um, and then we bring Kingdra back out. And yeah, so we just go for a Ancient Power into the Torkoal. And whatever's the most accurate. I'm just going to go for a flip turn. GG's acoustic. Glad to claim the badge. Sorry I went a little bit try <laughs> like a little bit hard on you with uh, the plethora of really top tier mons I brought, but at least it was something different. Flip turn into weakness policy, and if you didn't bring a sun mode, then King Joe was there to go for a swift swim with the Max Geyser from the Tyranitar. I, I thought it was kinda cool. Um Again, thanks for playing. I'll be uploading both of these matches, uh, both last challenge and this challenge. So stay tuned, guys. Um, one badge remaining. Till next time. Thanks for watching.